We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you, you have redeemed the world. From the prophet Isaiah, crushed because of our guilt, the punishment reconciling us fell on him, and we have been healed by his bruises. On your knees, under the cry of the world, heavily weighing on you, the pillar of the universe. Darkness and horror plunge onto the wood of your cross. The implacable, grim-faced judge, the tormented bodies of the victim, of violence and vices, the sin of the world. On your knees, the translucent flesh stained with blood, your right arm firmly strained, unbent, steady, like a pillar beam. The right hand firmly planted over the solid stone, supporting, securing. The head leaning on your heart, the source of your strength. Determined as you are to lose none of the little ones entrusted to you. You the cornerstone, you the pillar of the universe, you carry us all. We all know the feeling, I can't go on. The very life is being squeezed out of us. Lack of love in our lives can weigh us down. When we are rejected, we become vulnerable. We neither respect others nor ourselves. We become violent and abusive towards those who are more vulnerable than we are. Our human dignity is lost and we condemn ourselves to shame and degradation. Jesus died to save us from ourselves. He took away the sin of the world. He restored in us the likeness of the children of God. We pray, Jesus, you bore our sin so that we might live. You are the rock of our strength. Do not allow us to neglect those who are crushed by their own mistakes, those who feel rejected, the sinful. I love you, Jesus, my love above all things. I repent with my whole heart of having offended you. Never permit me to separate myself from you again. Grant that I may love you always, and then do with me what you will. 